Hello, my name is Sinvo, and welcome back to Satisfactory. Um, you're probably wondering why I'm not immediately going to Satisfactory right now. Is because I want to tell you guys a specific something. Um, I stream about Thursday, Friday, Saturdays every week, uh, around you know four to five, depending on the day. Um, and you know, as of late, I've realized that you know you guys probably want more long form content on the days of. So I'm thinking about taking away a streaming day, but adding a couple hours at the end. So if you guys are into that, that's great. If you guys want the extra Saturday stream, I'm happy to just pull it back. That's okay. Um, also, if you're new here and you're watching this on YouTube, like and subscribe. It's free and all that stuff. So, you know, don't feel too bad about, you know, just finding out what this rather chummy fellow is capable of doing. Right, uh, I have looked up, well, when I say looked up, I don't mean like, oh, I went to the wiki and started grinding, but, but I might as well have, because basically, I've seen a couple other Let's Plays, you know, that, you know, are beginning from scratch and all that stuff. And I realized I missed a major portion of this game. And I mean, like, a major portion. And I'm, I'm pretty sure that I started getting into it a little bit, but I didn't realize how serious of a part of the game this actually was, which was, in fact, the uh, mathematical part. Um, what I thought was the boring part was actually the part that you're supposed to care about the most. At least boring to what I thought was boring to viewers is what I want to say. So, um, for instance, right, this miner here has a, well, well I'm first of all going to say this, right? This miner has a lot of information that it's trying to tell me right now, right? First thing it's trying to tell me is, hey, this right here, I don't know if you guys can see my cursor. Yeah, you guys can see my cursor. That's great. Um, it's showing that this miner is doing 0%. Like, it's absolutely not having as much productivity as it possibly could have, right? It's saying, oh my gosh, Sinvo, I need something to happen here or else I'm doing absolutely jack shit nothing for the rest of the time here, right? This goes for this and all the other yellows as well, right? So let's look at our iron mine, right? Let's take a look over there. And you're going to see exactly what I mean. So for instance, let's go to our, our mine over here. Oh, this is our tractor here. Is it out of fuel? It might be out of fuel. I, yeah, it's out of fuel. Oh, well. I think I remember that I did something with the fuel systems and I got to change all that, but I, I, I kind of feel like stuff is, but you see this turned off. It's at 39, 42, like it's going up and down. It is not at a hundred percent, right? And it's pulling out like 60 per minute. The only reason why it's doing that and not working at maximum efficiency is because the things that are outside of it as well. First of all, these boxes, like I mean, like there's, it's good that they're there initially, but when it comes to the actual like splitting up of stuff, it need, like they're not really needed at all. Like this, this is working at hundred percent. That's not that's not our overload. This right here, this is working at eighty-seven percent. So this could use a lot more, you know. I've basically missed the productivity display, is what I'm trying to say. I have completely and utterly missed the productivity display. It has failed to see my eyes and ears and all that stuff. And now I'm basically in a lot of mess. That and, I mean, you guys can see for yourselves, the, the second plan of the many plans that I've tried to do has failed. And now we're in phase three. And phase three requires a lot more stuff than we need now, like a lot more. So we have our power thing situated. Our coal isn't coming in initially, right? And I think 
that, we need to check out the MAM, see what we can complete for today. And ooh, ooh, also another thing that I learned, right? I learned that there was a thing. Well, I thought there was a thing over here. Is there not a thing over here? Maybe I'm dumb. Maybe I'm dumb. Hold on. Oh, it might be in the it might be only in the new update. That might be the only thing. Yeah, I, I also learned that there's a new update that's coming in that I might switch to, depending on how these these things go. I don't know how you guys are if you guys are still interested in me completing this world or completing space elevator in this world, or if you want me to just go ahead and switch and make a brand new one. But you know, um, one or the other. But basically, right. Uh, I'm gonna go, to, I'm gonna check out the man. We're gonna see what we can complete out of it. I wanna see if we can get smart splitters. I wanna see if we can uh, go and, you know, grab as much of the productivity, logistic type stuff that we could possibly need. Maybe like look like our fix it, tix it, our fix it, tix it machines, fix it, tix it, really? Anyway, uh, let's look at our fix it coupons see if we can use the use our current ones right now to you know get a lot more stuff to be more logistic wise with i basically just, just missed all the logistics all the productivity all of that just missed it all just threw it all into the garbage it was just building for the sake of building thought eh, you just have to guess like even though it, they legitimately gave you the numbers right in front of you gosh sinfo oh it's almost like this is how what happens whenever you're coding too. But anyways, um, we're gonna do that. That's that's the idea. We're gonna go through that, and then once we get that part done, and we have everything that we could possibly get from the factory, everything that we could possibly generate, we're gonna delete everything. <sighs> At least up to well, even including the smelters actually. So I guess everything, and we're going to basically redo our iron mine and we're gonna have it build what it can build in its general vicinity right so that means that if we need to transport coal all the way over here in order for the stuff to work we aren't doing that we are gonna probably try to find iron on the other side in fact maybe we could probably just do that before we try to do that whole thing and make that a, like a completely separate episode so that would be something good at least that's that's the plan that's bumping around in my head right now. Because I've, I've always been talking about, oh, I want to like have like the smelting and some area and all this other stuff. Well, now we can actually do that. But, you know, in a smart way and not like this. Because, I mean, wouldn't it be cool to just have all this foundry stuff in a regular area <laughs> instead of the way it is now? I mean, there's probably iron where that coal is. They want you to be able to start the game somewhere, you know? I don't know. All right, let's check the man. We have a hard drive. I don't think we have any hard drives in our care. Right? Oh, another thing. Um, actually, I don't have anything to really show this. I want to have everything on a singular foundation. I, I don't think the way that things are built right now, everything's going to be in the same way. And I heard that if you press control, you're on the world grid or something like that. Which means that, I don't know. I feel like both of these aren't on the world grid. So yeah, that's gonna be a pain. All of this is gonna possibly be a pain. I might even do some of this off stream if I really feel I'm implied to do it, but you know, you guys are going to join me for the first better half of this. <laughs> like, look, we there's like, look at this. There's no possible way we can get through all of that. And like over here as a mega factory, unless we want to like bust like lines all the way over through here. Like we're just not at that level yet. It's, I think it's just much smarter to, well, another coal drop has happened. I think it's just much smarter. I'm gonna actually take some of this coal and put it in our tractor. 
over here. It's just much smarter to have more things a lot more modularized. Like the trucks can the trucks can deliver stuff. That's fine. It's just like they were telling us something when they said, "Hey, your truck station seems to be a bit long. Either have a break point or figure out how else to get iron over there." So, you know, grab some coal. Oh, oh god. All right, so checking out the man. That's the first thing we're going to do. Check out the man. And then we'll reinvent everything. <laughs> That's the thing, too. Once we do that, once we, like, start breaking all of this down, this is our major power spender, our, the iron mine over here. We can take, up, take away all these biomass burners. Like, just get rid of them. They're, they're just so clunky and big and in the way. Plus, I don't really pay attention to biomass all that much anymore, so... It'd be a good idea. So, alien organisms. Is there anything quick we can do here? No. Uh, this requires a crystal oscillator and an object scanner. I'm pretty sure we have an object scanner somewhere, but not in our current care. Um, Gaterium. Gaterium wire and plastic, I think. I think, I think that's plastic, right? Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> This, however, is Smart Splitter, and this requires uh, AI limiters. Do we have those already? Yes. So, um, let me see if I can just build the AI limiters, like, off the rip, you know? We don't need to... Well, it looks like we can build these on our own, too. Like, we have the crystals. And it's, I think the crystals is the, is the thing that's holding us back, actually. Think about it. But if I take this and make it the quartz crystal, 5, 10, 15, and then crystal oscillator, oh, it needs 36 in total. Anyway, that's not what we're here for. Um, we were here to see if we can build the AI limiter. And we just need Caterium wi quick wire for it. So if I can find the quick wire somewhere. Quick wire? Pretty sure quick wire is in one of these boxes. That's circuit board, not an AI limiter. There it is. We'll take that and we'll build Five AI limiters, I think, is what they wanted. One, two, three, four, and then finally five. All right, cool. We'll use that to Ooh, map. Probably should focus on that too. Like we just want to get as much as we can off of this that's sensible. Like, five AI limiters. You saw how quickly we got that. That's not too bad to, to manually build. But, like, you know. Oh, it's ten. Okay, cool. We have enough for that, I'm pretty sure. I think I... Like, for instance, right? I'm pretty sure that there's some copper around that caterium that we could totally use. We could, like, use, like, a... Like, like for instance, right? This This is another problem that I saw. Right here, you see how like we initially built this to kind of just like go up. Well, we have like, I thought in my opinion, and I don't know, something in my brain told me that these were super expensive. Like, oh, they were, they were gonna like drain me of all the stuff that I need. Meanwhile, they were completely fine. <laughs> in fact, they, they were just, they were just legitimately just twice as big and that's okay. And it's not that big of a deal. I mean, we we literally had a conveyor belt run from here all the way to the coal mine, but by then I didn't know that, so. Um, you look here, and we have the smart splitter. We'll start that. That's five minutes. Um, what's the next one, by the way? So that way we're going to get that kind of prepared. We have the crystal oscillators. Crystal oscillators... We need the object scanner, which I think is in here, and then crystal oscillators. So 
to make crystal oscillators um well let's see but not only do we because i'm pretty sure we need more than just uh ooh, we could make 50 but i'm not going to do that because yeah that sounds rough <laughs> Can be switched on and off to enable the, the connection between two power grids. Okay. Uh, hmm. Anyways. A power poles mark three sounds pretty cool, but no thanks. Uh, with with like with this in the way, I don't know how to make plastics, so. We need five here for object scanner improvements. And then for the we need to find some more sulfur. Then for this, ooh, 20? 20 crystal oscillators? How much time would it take to make a single crystal oscillator? 18! Okay, well, that's that takes way too long. <laughs> I I think I got I think I gotta give up on that. <laughs> I think the smart splitter might be the only thing we're getting here because the crystal oscillators take 18 per. It's such a long time. Especially if we're trying to get like 25 or so. Yeah, we got to get our shit together for that one. Um, What do crystal oscillators need again to be made? They need wire, reinforced iron plates, and quartz crystal. So, what I think we can do is have whatever excess reinforced iron plates that we find. Like, like what is this? Like, why isn't this working? It's it's at forty five percent. It's waiting on steel beams, and steel beams, like there's coal right here, and it's like doing jack crap, nothing, you know. It's it's stacking up for fuel. Like, I'm just gonna take this hundred fuel. Like, uh, well, no, I'm not, because the other ve the vehicle needs fuel. Ugh. Anyway, also I learned about the load balances on this, right? Um, I said load balances. Uh, the load, how you can load this, right? Basically, uh, these have specific numbers of what they can load, and it doesn't really matter if they're fast or not. It matters how much they can hold, and I didn't understand that initially. So, that's pretty insane for me to learn. But all right, um, it seems like all we can do is kind of wait for the smart splitter, which is unfortunate. Oh, we can also look for sulfur. Let's, let's do that. Let's look for sulfur real quick and see what we can find with it. Sulfur, please. Of course, it's super fucking far away. Like, holy crap, man. Is there no sulfur here? Holy crap. See, this is what I mean, you know, like, are we seriously gonna have to drive all the way? You know, like, that doesn't make any sense. It makes more sense to like, you know, use the mine that we have over here as efficiently as we can, have the parts drive to where they need to go, than for us to be like, oh, I'm just going to bring everything to this far off place, you know? At least that's how I feel. Like have everything work the way it can with what it has, and then you know, if it's impossible to, you know, benefit off of it anymore, then that that's it. You know, that's all we can do. If if it's if it's only capable of making a thousand rotors, then it that's its that's its purpose from now on. You know, that's that's what it will do. Just continually make rotors for the rest of its life, and we'll move someplace else for it. I think there's a man up there. That's quartz. And grab it. Also, 
you know, the amount of effort we've put in to this place has been really, really, really hard. I mean, like, look, we have like the, oh, oh, oh my God, so much. There's so much that it's like popping up in my head now. Okay, where are you, asshole? I hear you. Whatever. Uh, basically, right, um, I think by now the video of me uh, falling off this bridge should have been out by now. And basically, uh, I got roasted in the, <laughs> in the DMs for that one. I, I basic because uh, I didn't pay attention to how the uh, fix it stations work. Remember when I said, oh, it's all just like, you know, topical stuff like this stuff doesn't really help you in the game. Meanwhile, it could could have really helped me in the game to have like wall nodes for this power line that we have here, especially for the tractor. But anyways. I thought I heard fire, but it wasn't fire. Anyways, um. It looks like. This is pulling out like what? 120 coal per minute? And this line can hold how much? 270, so it's completely fine. That's the thing though, as fine as it may be, like, it's not filling up as fast as we would like it to, right? Like, it's not gonna fill that whole thing up for some reason. I don't know. Um, is there, sul is there sulfur over here? If you notice, we have a lot more options here for things. Okay, that's cool that it showed up. Oh, and we also have that up there. I don't know how to like mark that, but you know. We can't be afraid anymore. We have to go on and explore and remake our stuff. Oh, I said I was going to look at the map up here before I left, so let me, let me do that real quick. Pretty sure there's map up here. Ugh, I hate spiders. I know that's probably not the spiders, but... Ugh, you know? Oh, is there not a man up here? there's not well ma'am I'll give you one here you go ma'am I hear like big whooshing no noises I think it's just that guy. We're gonna head back. A part of me says I should just like Fortnite up that wall, but a part of me just says maybe there's a way up there naturally. I kind of want to explore the natural way first. Okay, so. It's a deep cavern. Is there a way down there naturally, I wonder? Probably not. Oh, that one found me.
alien carapace. I'm trying to see, is that like quartz or is that like, okay. Okay, I see you. He fell. All right, so I've entered a pit. A pit to, to battle. Ow, that hurt. All right, so basically, as I was taking it slow, they didn't like that. Oh, hi. <laughs> the ragdoll physics in this game sometimes. All right. Um, I don't see anything else of value. So I guess I'll just fight this thing and be done. Pretty sure this is like the rough one. Okay, I aggroed him. He's coming. He's a coming. Okay. Uh, hello. He's coming. Where, where is he? Where did he go? Oh, there he is. All right, cool. All right, there we go. Sweeping victory. Now we get now we get our rewards. Oh, whoops. Have you gotten a yellow one yet? Pretty sure we've gotten a yellow one. But I, I wasn't like super sure. You know? Alright, so far. That's Sam or right? Uh, up there? Is that a cave? It's not a cave. Maybe we can go around. Ooh, this is kind of scenic. Woo! Oh my god, those spawned right on top of me. That's a hoot. All right, where? I hate when this happens. I'm like looking around, trying to, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> if I die to this. I'm not going to die to this. Thank you. This is bauxite. I don't know what to do with that yet. I hope this isn't like a swamp-like area. I feel like it's up. All right. I think I have an idea. It's a dumb idea, but I have an idea nonetheless. Remember these stackable little conveyor poles? You can probably use that and try to go... Oh, I didn't put it in the zoom mode. I do that. Try to use that to go up. And then see if there's a natural way down. Up, 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 up. Oh crap, poison flowers. How much you wanna bet this is completely covered in poison? Oh, oh, oh. Am I dead? I'm not dead, not dead, not dead, we're fine. Speaking of which.
Hmm. I mean, there has to be a way. And it's entirely possible that, like, you just can't get to sulfur without... Excuse me? You probably just can't get to sulfur without having, like, poison control first. Because sulfur is pretty stanky, you know? Like, I don't know if any of you have ever smelled sulfur in per person, but you could definitely kill someone with the smell. Stank. Stank worse than, like, baby poop. It's like the definition of stink. It's the stink element. It also can blow shit up, but, you know, we don't talk about that very much. All right. Well, I feel like this has basically just told us that we can't really benefit off of anything anymore. That we just have to go on and, you know, handle the iron mine. Oh my gosh. I got randomly super lost for a second there. I have no idea why. Okay, I'm going to head back up there. Even though we were just up there. Because I want to make sure that there might be iron up there. And if there's iron up there, I need to get that iron instead of the iron that's all the way bumfuck here, you know? And if that's not the case, then perhaps our system the way it is just needs a little bit of a revamp on how coal is being used, you know? Yeah, I see you. It's like he comes out and he hisses at me and then he like walks back home. He's like, how dare you come into my abode trying to do all this stuff and I'm like, bro, come at me then. And he's like, nah, I'm good. I'm good. I don't want the smoke. I'm just here to yell at you. Really, <laughs> really drives the, the, the stuff in. <laughs> Sorry, my fiance scared me. <laughs> Ugh. Anyway. drives the stuff in. Anyways, uh, what's it called? Heading over here. Okay, now we're where the, where our coal is being processed, right? Where all three of our coal, coal mines are. So let's check out for iron. Okay, over here by 500 meters. Am I, gonna, am I about to walk off a clip? Cliff, 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 cliff. Yes. But um, it does show a different area that we've never been to before. So I'm not too super concerned. We can head back down here and then try to travel across to over here. You think I have the wherewithal to do that? I probably do. If we can do that, then we can take that iron and push it up here and then create steel here instead of. We could even like position the coal to move down instead of up or out from here, because don't we have like three different locations where coal is? So we can totally like have one of them just be like, OK, well, I'm a handle like all this. And then, you, you know, you guys can handle the power and then we're all good until I need power. Then I'm like, oh, crap, I guess I need to have another thing there. Hello, Furiosa. I didn't even know you were still online. Okay. So I think here is where it was at. Okay, so here, iron. Four forty seven.
here, I think. Oh, wait, that's too much. What the heck? What was that? I hear things, but I don't, like, see things. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go up. See if we can get to this iron. It's, it's, it doesn't matter if it's in pure. We'll just, you know, account for that. Obviously, I'd want it to be pure. But, you know, beggars can't be choosers. Somewhere here, right? Oh, there's a foundation here. It looks like I was here before. Well, here it is. And what's guarding it is another flower thing. Alright, there we go. Alright, so what is this node? Pure! That's pretty good. So we can take this pure node and we can use that to make steel uh, by pointing it over here. Luckily, we have like a good vision of it. It will be a bit weird, actually, to kind of get it up there. It's either going to have to go by tractor. But I mean, tractors have been like what's been going on here anyway. Oh, also, there's stuff up there. Is there a way up there naturally? Oh, I see kind of like a way. I see a way. I am completely uh... I thought this is a natural way but it doesn't look like it anymore a lot closer coal though So, in this case, we're probably going to have to just come up here with foundation. Unfortunate that we have to do that. I don't want to do that. I want to do this. Okay. And I swear, I always think that I'm in zoop mode and then I'm not. R? Alright, I did get a bunch of different stuff. Uh. Oh, I think this burst. I don't even know where that was. Oh, right there. Not enough space. What could I possibly ditch for this? Well, I could. I could, uh, ditch maybe these modular frames. The copper sheets we have a ton of, though. So, um, do this. And then we'll have the alien carapace. 
there sulfur here? No. All right. Cool. So this iron will then go up there. How do I kind of denote that? It's not like I have the miner here. But what I can do, actually, I can probably just do this. I'll build a... What's it called? Production equipment workshop. Build it right here. Okay. And we'll build our... Not the Xeno Zapper, but the... Portable Miner. It's, it's another thing in inventory for it. It's because of this crystal oscillator and a bunch of other stuff that it didn't ditch. Actually, if we go and craft, we can probably get rid of, get rid of a bunch of stuff. This? Yes. Okay. We can stack up. Let's see. Either stack up for more wire. Oh, I just need to sort. Oops. Oopsie doozy. Okay. That. Then we will. We could go and take this. I don't have enough space to pick that up anyway. So if we do this. You should also put that half stack of nuts in your hand. That is very true. I could do that. That is actually the, uh, probably the smarter idea. <laughs> if this would occupy, why is this being such a, anyway. We'll do that, and then maybe we'll have the Xenobasher here. And 100 here. Also, slugs, power shards, and clear two more space, two more spaces. I do have I do have power shards on me, don't I? Yes, I do. That's a good idea as well. Dang. Thank you, uh, Orkin. Besides, I don't know what else I'm going to be using these power slugs for, because I'm pretty sure I got the yellow one already. I'm pretty sure. If I didn't, that's going to be a sad moment, but I'm pretty sure there's others out there. That's 18. We may have had similar issues in the past. Makes sense. Uh, from the perspective, execute the extraction rate's 120. I think we can probably upgrade our, our coal mine up there. But that's for another story. We, we need a, at least one miner here. kind of want it to be on the world grid. Because everything's going to end up having to be on the world grid soon. Looks can only be used in the research. Making shards for the body can only ever be used to make shards. Yeah, I kind of assumed so. Uh, Let's see. This is on the world grid, right? Because I'm holding control. So this is as good as it's going to get. I can like right there. And then let's see if this miner still, yes, it's fine with that. It is okay with that. Okay, so what I'll do, actually look at it from behind. See if I can align it. I think it's gonna have to be just like that. That or this. Like that. Because it's, isn't it going, it's going this direction-ish. So, yeah, I think it's going to have to go this way. Because what's, it, oh, I have to destroy this thing. If I want to, whatever. Um, basically, we're going to have to just have this be its own thing for a little bit. Like we can't even process power to it. I just want to make sure that we have something here. Kind of know that it's there, you know? That way that, that way, it's easy to find, you know? And then we'll get on with the rehashing. OK. 
Okay, so this... I think that's right. No, I want the equipment workshop back. I want to get rid of this. I'm going to put a beacon here. I heard they're getting rid of beacons. I don't know why. But, you know. They each developer their own, I guess. Okay. Put a beacon right here. That'll let us know that we have iron there. Iron here that can be processed for steel, so I'll just... Where did I just put those beacons? Okay, they're right there. Come on. Put that right there. Configure it to say... Iron for steel. Alright. We got something done out here. We didn't, we didn't end up finding any sulfur. But, I mean, like, there probably is sulfur that we can find that that's going to seem like more of a hassle. I'm kind of kind of trying to think if I'm going to kind of try to think. Yeah, that's a great way to say that they're getting rid of equipment and making the function just built into the map. Oh. Oh, I didn't know that. I mean, that's kind of cool. I guess they were down. I guess they just didn't feel good about the equipment stuff then. They're just like, eh. It's cool, but like. There's cooler stuff that we could do. It's like a second craft bench. I get it. I get it a little bit. Anyways, so if we wanted a truck to come up here. Ooh, is this? This is uh, concrete, right? Yeah, this looks like a starting area, you know? Which is funny because I'm definitely not going to use it the way they want me to. Um, we, can, I, we can either drive a bus all the way up here on foundation to go up there I think so we can drive we can drive a bus here and then have it travel and then just go up and up and up to that coal um we can do that actually that sounds like the best strategy than having a truck do anything because trucks are so expensive when it comes to gas and stuff it seems like the best idea for this. So what I'll do to remind myself of that idea when we make it up here is simply do something that would make no sense to me, right? And I hope that this works. Um, there's no foundation here, so it's going to be off the world grid. I'm going to do this. And it's going to be like, okay, why is this here? Oh, isn't this the iron to, to steel thing? I guess I have to put this conveyor lift all the way up there to where the other coal is. Huh. Forward thinking. Prevention of idiocy. Huh? Huh? Also, what are you? That was fast. Um. So yeah. We are, th I think we have to head back now. I think I'm just trying to escape the inevitable. That is a cave. Poison in it. Like, that is... Those are poisoners. Is this the little, like, cliff side that... Yeah, this is that cliff side. I made it up here. That's really cool. All right. I've been looking at this cliff side as if it's impossible to get to. Meanwhile, it's a walk away. Man. Ah. I am so blind when I played this game. But we're going to try to be less blind. That's the quartz, right? Yeah, that's quartz. You probably have to do some stuff over there too. Figure out why whenever we go over there we get shot at with blue fire. Uh, that's something weird. Blue plasma. But that's not our focus. Not our focus at all. see how long have we been up for it says 55 oh crap and I've been lollygagging for the first hour <laughs> that's not good all right let's let's head back let's actually get stuff done